Imagine you've got a history exam. The history exam says the following. Did Jesus die for your sins? Did Jesus die on the cross? Was he resurrected? Two questions. I say no. I click on both things and I have academic reasons. I say that no, I don't believe he was crucified or resurrected or any of that stuff. So that means because I have this view of history as a historian or an academic or otherwise, that now I must spend my entire afterlife and eternity sizzling, burning, cracking, popping in a fire. Do you think that was something that a merciful God would do? If I don't believe that Jesus died for my sins i must be eternally damned doomed destroyed in a hellfire forever this is not a religion brother that makes any sense and if you're sincere brother i'm saying to you there's only one solution which is to believe there's only one god that is the creator of the heavens and the earth that is not begotten does not have children he doesn't himself is not a child of anybody there's nothing like him he's the all-powerful one he's the all-knowing one he is the one who wills anything that he wants to will that's the god that we should believe in that's what's going to give you power and strength